Hi everybody. Today I'm here to share with you my uh, design team package for Helmer Adhesives. And uh, this is my second term with Helmer. I really, really like their products. Uh, it's a variety of uh, adhesives and uh, there's also cleaners. Uh, like for example, there's one that you can clean like your scissors or wax off stuff and like sticky residue and whatnot. So just a variety of stuff. Uh, you, I'll put down the link to the website, but you can also find their products over at Joann's and Hobby Lobby, I believe. But uh, all the information will be down below in the description along with the, the creative team blog as well because we have new team members. And so, yeah, so um, I guess I'll begin with this uh, quilt basting spray. Um, some of the other sprays that I have from the last DT I hadn't used because I wanted to use some of the other adhesives first. Um, but I want to start using the sprays because now I can actually go outside and spray outside where I can get some air. So this is a quilt basting spray. It's uh, to rip, you know, rip, repositional, <laughs> I can't even say that, repositional temporary bond, uh, will not gum needle, no smell colorless, and um, so I've been wanting to start um, quilting and, and stuff like that because my mom used to quilt a lot and so um, something that I would like to look into. So. Um, Hopefully I'll have a chance this summer to do that. So there is that. And uh, this is one of my favorite adhesives. This is the Helmer Craft Glue. And it dr uh, dries clear, it's washable, uh, sets quickly. You can use it on hobbies, lampshades, fabrics, paper, leather, lace, trim. So it's pretty much like the the 450 uh, this one right here this is the quick dry adhesive general purpose crystal clear quick drying machine washable um, so that craft glue is pretty similar to to this one I really really like these um, and then of course there is another one that I like as well and it's this one right here a fabric glue and flexible bond grabs extra fast machine washable sets quickly permanent uh, used for fabrics bridal wear hats lace trim felt upholstery and more and so yeah there's that one because I've already used a, a lot of this one it's like a little bit past half I love using this and so there's that one this time I picked out this wash and wear glue. Um, it's pretty much like the fabric and it's appliques, lace, ribbon, um, etc. Machine wash and dry. So it stays even after washing and, and putting it in the dryer. So um, I'm excited to try that one. And this time I got two of these, which I'm super excited. Um, I really love love this one. I still have a tiny bit of this one, but it's almost gone. So this one is nice because um, instead of using the foam dots and uh, stuff like that, you can use this because you can put it at any level you want uh, to add dimension to some of your um, embellishments and whatnot. So there's those two. You, I suggest this is a, a good one too. Um, this one here I thought I would try. It's called Fray Stopper. And <laughs> it uh, stops fraying of fabrics, hems, and seams. Which is good because sometimes my ribbon decides it's going to fray. And then I have to glue it uh, with or hot glue it with my hot glue gun. So, um... This looks like a, a really good one here. It's called Phrase Stopper. Stop. Uh. <laughs> and then, 
Um, okay, so then I asked, um, let me see, hold on, what did I get here? Okay, so then, actually, I got this one. This is a PVA Professional Woodworking Glue. So, um, like I said, I really want to do more projects this summer, which I'm able to be able to do some stuff outside or, stuff, you know, wood, work with wood and stuff like that. This one here is a Tiger Grip. Uh, it's all-purpose glue, um, paper card, paper card, wood, plastics, metal, cork, fabric, carpets, leather, canvas, and many others. So this is basically almost like this, except it isn't clear, but it dries clear. Um, yeah, so, uh, let's look, take a look at it. Yeah, it's just white. Um, so yeah, th these are good adhesives, and it's nice to have a variety to choose one, and they're you know, to choose from, and they're very inexpensive. Um, I think, like, these run, like, maybe, like, two to three dollars, or four. I, I don't remember. I know I saw some for, like, two, two dollars, three dollars, and so, stuff like that. And then I did ask, uh, the DT coordinator about some of their products that they had on there that I hadn't seen anybody, um, demonstrate or you know and so um, I asked if it'd be possible if I could do that and um, yeah she she went ahead and sent me these so <laughs> surprising these are the firearm cleaners and because uh, I would like to clean my firearm <laughs> and um, that way I can you know um, demonstrate these and so, yeah, so this one here, um, this one here is a bore cleaner. General purpose, um, removes light to moderate fouling from lead, copper, and powder, safe for new firearms, maintains accuracy of your firearm, for ideal for handguns, rifles, and shotguns. So, um, and then, like, some of these are pretty similar to this, they're just separate. Um, like this one here is the firearm, firearm copper remover. So it's, like I say, it has what this has as well. And, um, let me see, which one, this one here is a carbon remover. So, um, it is also like this one. But I'll be demonstrating all these on a video, um, later this, later this, uh, summer or, uh, early fall or something. And then these here are the oils and lubricant. Um, it protects uh, dry lubricant, uh, sup superior corrosion resistance, does not attract dust. This one here is uh, pretty much the same. So yeah, um, I'm very fortunate to be on this design team. I really, really like doing uh, their projects and uh, promoting their products and so um, like I say we have new designers and I will put a link down in the description box uh, where we announce where they announced the the new members and um, I hope that you'll go take you know subscribe to the blog and whatnot and um, if you have any questions or comments please leave them down in the description box and I will uh, answer them as best as I can and so, um, and they have also have Facebook and uh, Instagram, so I will put all the social media uh, websites down below. And I hope that you will subscribe if you haven't yet, and um, hope you like my video. And please feel free to leave me comments. I, I really, really like enjoying, I like, enjoy, uh, I enjoy reading your comments. And so, um, yeah, so I hope everyone has a good day, and, uh, I will talk to you soon. Happy crafting. Bye.